The Milimani Law Courtroom 85 was fully packed with the prosecutor's sign full of anticipation that they will find justice when the judge makes a ruling against a murder case involving the death of Sharon Otieno, a second-year student at Rongo University. Zachary Okotho Bado, who is the chief suspect in the engineering of the murder of her lover Sharon Otieno, was also hopeful that the court will grant him a bond and allow the case to proceed after he had spent three days in cold cell at the Gigiri police station as the judge read him his charge. Represented by four lawyers, among them Cliff Ombeta and Nicholas Ombija, Obado denied the offense of aiding and abating the commission of felony termed as murder levied against him as his lawyer plead to have him released on bond. And after hearing the case, which had been delayed due to court technicalities, Lady Justice Jesse Lesit of the Milimani Law Courts directed that the accused should spend a night at the industrial area GK prison remand cell till Tuesday when the court shall hear and make a ruling on Obado's bail application. Now the charge is murder contra section 203, as read with section 204 of the penal code, and the particulars are that you, Zakaria Okodo Obado, between the 3rd and the 4th of September this year, at Owade area in Rachuonyo sub-county within Homabi County, joined with others not, not before murdered Sharon. It is a matter that has raised many questions than answers among them. Will justice prevail or the matter will just fizzle out like other high-profile cases which have involved the county chiefs, with the latest being that one involving Ali Korane, Garissa's county governor? Secondly, why does Mr. Obado deny the claims when his confidants like Michael Oyamo had an upper hand at the execution of a girl who was once Obado's girlfriend? John Chacha, Obado's bodyguard who has been at large since the murder of Sharon at Kodere Forest and whose last phone signal was traced at Kodere, has been arrested today at the cafeteria near the Milimani Law Courts. Outside the court, youth allied to Obado have strongly objected the case as social groups and activists demand for justice for the late Sharon's family.